एम एस धोनी हैज मेड इज वे टू द मिडल he has been uh, literally a find of the tour and uh, we have been praising him a lot uh, jawagal and i think <laughs> the first thing you notice about him the way he walks to the crease he's got a purposeful walk looks very confident is not tentative at all and if he can carry his good form uh, in today's match uh, they'll do wonders they are talented but uh, we have to put them into process superb stroke by dhoni Look at that! It went like a bullet. When uh, this guy hits the ball, it remains hit. This end of uh, Riyadh Afridi is over. Twelve for one. And look at that shot. And the way he finishes the the bat over his head, reminiscent of uh, some of the great stroke players of the past. I just hope that uh, you know such a enormous wealth of talent is not wasted. So I don't want to talk too much uh, about this lad. Still a long way to go for Dhoni. Oh that can be a very crucial miss. Dropped in the second slip. A terrific delivery from Iftikhar Rao. MS Dhoni just trying to Play that one away from his body. Got the outside edge. Was slightly away towards the second slip fielder. Dhoni is feeling the heat now. Pakistani bowlers are all pumped up. Fairly an easy chance for the second slip fielder. And that was the captain, Miss Baul Haq, who has dropped Dhoni. Shot and pulled inside. He loves to play these pull shots. Iftikhar Rao bowled bowled this one very short. M S Dhoni had enough time to go back on the back foot and play that pull shot in front of square. It just shows that he is picking the ball so early. Yes, that shows a lot of confidence uh, from Dhoni, and as I see him more. I am enjoying to watch him as a cricketer. Eight, especially after a bad start. Excellent shot in the mid-wicket region by Dhoni. Ball pitched up to him and making good use for the strength on the onside. This is not good stuff by Iftikhar Rao. Lacking in discipline there. There are only two fielders on the onside. One standing at long leg and the other one at mid on. And there's huge open area near the mid-wicket and square leg region, and if you bowl in that area, well, you're bound to be punished, and that's what uh, MS Dhoni did. <laughs> This time he gets it through. Very good back foot shot by M S Dhoni. Just a punch of the back foot, but it found the gap also. A welcome boundary for India A. Yes, he punched it, and the timing on that was impeccable and well placed between the two field. So Dhoni is the in-form batsman, having got a hundred against them a few days. back so is an important uh, wicket for both teams superb stroke look at that hit with such power very strong forearms uh, junaid at this time drifting on uh, dhoni's legs and uh, you can't expect to be pardoned it's the eternal sin in one day cricket uh, if you bowl on the leg side pull up hardly any protection on the leg side so it's a free hit yes with the field placing miss by's cap for zia was not a good delivery bowling to the strength of dhoni if the ball is above the shoulder level it could it might be called as a no ball but if you keep on bowling the short balls uh, there's less chance that dhoni will just come out like that and uh, hammer you over your head 
what a brilliant stroke that was that's a powerful shot by Dhoni when you're hit like that uh, no no doubt that uh, you've gone for four runs you can severely dent your confidence as well just dismissed from his presence and really not expected at this level uh, Saba and after that drop catch you see a boundary here Junhead Zaya there not enjoying it a wee bit and you can't blame him absolutely right Asif and his comeback spell here oh, this is the shot that uh, Dhoni played got the gap quite well and that one thudded into the fence he got to wait for his chance and uh, do justice as and when he gets a chance a lot of great cricketers actually miss out at the right opportunities. Absolutely, that's a very important point. Now, that was a brilliantly flighted ball, and that's what he needs to vary. As a left arm spinner, you've got to vary and uh, close shout. And the umpire has called for the replay. Ms. Dhoni called for the second run. Gautam Gambhir there responding, but we'll have to wait and see. Good pick up and throw by Navid Latif from the deep. And on the full, well, not on the full, straight in the hands of uh, Kaiser Abbas. Well, it seems from the replay that he has made the ground. And Mahindra Dhoni also on his 50 after 67 deliveries with six boundaries. Well, Dhoni has decided to step up the gas further and he's gone for the big one and a real big one and Kesar Abbas is not too pleased but Dhoni gets six runs for his team moving on to 138 for one and umpires have called in for replacement ball The crowd here loving it. They have come with the tricolors and they couldn't ask for more. Brilliant batting by Mahindra Singh Dhoni. It's another big one from Dhoni. The fielder tried to jump and get it, but uh, no chance. He didn't get a hang of it straight away. Thought it was a miss hit, but the ball carried nonetheless. Mind you, Vasan, it has gone through extra covers again, and uh, it's a classic shot. It's not an easy shot to play over extra covers. Well, the best thing is gone with the spin. Excellent shot again, once again. Beautiful shot over extra covers, in and out. And that's falling short, 10 yards before the boundary and that fetches him four runs excellent shot by Dhoni well this was effortless this is power cricket he had made up his mind to go after it the ball was really not there but still went through with that it's very strong in that region extra cover region look at that talking about Dhoni's value as a keeper Indians were looking for a wicket keeping batsman I mean, uh, he's been my favorite so far in the Indian team, and I hope he gets an opportunity uh, in the near future. Well, to be honest, I had not heard much of him. I knew that the, the guy named Ms. Dhoni keeping for Bihar. I never knew that this guy was such a prodigious talent. Uh, but surely you can see the raw material is there and uh, handled properly. He can be a really handful at the top level as well. Look at that. That is uh, Dhoni for you, blazing away. He came into bat after the fall of Dhiraj Jada's wicket, but that's the only blemish. Mizbahul Haq uh, unable to latch onto that one, but after that, he was in irrepressible form. Excellent stuff from uh, Dhoni. He played shots all around the wicket. Quite severe for anything that was pitch shot, as well as his drives were there for the taking. And some impeccable shots uh, towards the onside as well, and this was simply bludgeoned.
has been excellent stuff from Dhoni and that was the first to the towering six he hit of Faisal Abbas and then once more of Mansoor Amjad stepping out in style and getting the maximum and this was an effortless shot just flowing beautiful shot beautiful shot between the gap here goes on the rocks on the back foot cuts it well between the players point and gully and Tony picks up four more shot little bit of room but he waited and he waited enough to put that ball in the right area just opening the blade of his bat youngsters watching this shot good lesson what a fine placement that was Saba he took his time he got his uh, position right Dhoni batting on 95 uh, he's been there for just over three hours now and inching towards uh, another landmark the second hundred in this tri series oh what a superb stroke Getting to his 100 by a 6. Look at that. We have been uh, praising this young fellow. And he has shown why he's so special. And Dhoni's majestic shot. Clearing the boundary onto the crowd. And yes, you could see as soon as he hit that ball, he knew where he was getting to. And I'm sure that's very satisfying for Dhoni. And he's a lucky fellow as well. I think uh, it's not very often the A team matches are televised live. Millions of people watching him get these 200s would surely make him a star back home. Yes, excellent 102 from Mahindra Dhoni, his second 100 in this try series nine fours and three sixes to complete his hundred well, how many times would you see that a person get to a hundred uh, by hitting a six shows that supreme confidence he has in his own ability oh glorious shot huge hit once again this was coming you could tell that Dhoni was getting impatient. He was waiting for the one which was tossed up. This time got to the pitch of the ball and punched it with such power. Yes, what was good about it is he stepped out. And his timing and flow was brilliant to watch. And normally you see batsmen going uh, or trying to go across the line. But this guy is hitting it straight and that's it. Finishing his style, he got to the 100 with a 6 and uh, he has ensured India's victory with two consecutive 6s. What a star. Mahendra Singh Dhoni finishing on 119. Not out. And look at the smile on his face. It's totally demoralized the Pakistani attack. Yes, and why not? He should enjoy it. And uh, a great finish to another great win for India A. So India... They're passing the total in the 45th over, India winning another game. This is how it happened. Powerful blow. Mansoor Amjad, the unfortunate fellow. Amjad going for 68 runs in those 10 overs. What was good about Dhoni is that he's not only getting runs, more importantly, he's enjoying his cricket. This is the batting art, very impressive. India winning by eight wickets. Mahindra Singh Dhoni, 119.